hello guys so this video is about how i charge my electric scooter nine months later after buying it from alibaba for for one thousand two hundred and forty dollars us dollars so 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 this is what my scooter looks like like right now like i bought it nine months ago I, like a lot of stuff have changed from from when i got it like like now i only got one brakes the chip alibaba i mean the chip alibaba break that came with it i took it off because because it was because i couldn't refill it like i couldn't bleed it when when uh, when i was out of liquid so i've had several crashes but nothing serious so like as you guys can see i have some few crashes i've replaced like i put homes like i've done many many stuff on it but the, the a good part of it is that it's still running nine months later guy like nine months later it's still running it still charges my phone everything works now i don't have a seat that man, man the seat gave out like man the seat went bad like man, the seat post break i think i have it somewhere around here let me see this is a seat but i don't have the seat post but let me see i think i have it somewhere Around. but so the steel plate i know i mean i think i trash it i trash it guys i trash the the seat post but let me see if i have the the stand i bought a i bought a new seat stand like the one that stands straight i bought a new one so before like the steel plate that was somewhere around here when i sit it will lift up because it wasn't thick enough so i went and bought this one but i soon realized that this one was just as thick as the one that came with it so it wasn't thick enough then i went and bought this one which is like nine millimeters i'm mean seven point something millimeters thick this one is very thick but so i'm gonna put it right here i'm gonna take because I don't have the original one that came with the scooter, so this is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna tell the person who, who I mean, that's gonna do it to like because man, I drew this from the from the old seat, so I'm gonna tell the person to to cut it like this. So when he, when the person weld, so when he cut this one like this one like all this joint, I want him to cut it the way he sees. I want, I want him to cut this one the way this one is. But I'm not gonna use this one, so I'm just gonna tell him like to cut. Like a center, a square, then put it here and then weld it, weld it and then weld the the seat post that goes up in the center here. Yeah. After cutting it, it's somewhere around there like this, like this. So, but but that's how my scooter looks like. Then the controllers, the controllers are now outside, which means I have a huge space for battery. Then also. I don't charge it anymore with the with the DC 67 volt arm charger. I use I now use the i charger 308, which is fast. The reason is because you know, in, like instead of buying instead of buying like a a, a 45 amp hour battery or 10 amp hour battery for the scooter, purposely be for the scooter that cost like 700 800 dollars. I went ahead. I was I was so lucky, like very very lucky, because one guy posted a video. I mean, he posted a, a listing of like bunch of Sanyo Sanyo three thousand five hundred milliamp cells on eBay. So when I saw it, I first bought about I bought one the first time to to try it. Then when I mean I didn't even try it. I I realized that many people were buying it, so I went ahead. And bought as much as, as I as I could, so I wanna buy like I think 15 packs. If should each of each pack had like 10, 32 Sanyo 3500 milliamp cells, so like I I end up having more than I needed. So so these are the remaining ones. All these ones they are Sanyo cells. I haven't used them. They came out of they came out of the the. The I man, how they calling it? Medical packs, but no, I, I've, they've all been here for like, since I mean, this one had, 
an issue, but it's still good. This, this I've been here for like years. I end up building another battery pack for my scooter. I don't need it. It's sitting there. I put it on eBay. Maybe someone's gonna buy it. This one is 16s, 28 amp power. It's, yeah, it's actually 28 point. 28,900 and something amp power, but I just said 28 amp power. I built it the same way I built my main battery pack. So this one here is like 42 amp power. When if I discharge it from 4.2 volt to if I discharge it from 4.2 volt to 3 3 volt, it gives me 45 amp power. But I don't really do that. I just when it's like around 3.3.56, I charge it back up. So that's what I've been doing. So I haven't charged it for like five days. So now this is when when I'm charging it. It's probably gonna take like it's gonna take like I don't know one hour, fifty ten minutes or two hours, ten minutes like that. It depends on but I, I don't think it's gonna take longer. But this this one is the same thing. You see I build it the same way I build my main battery pack. So I put it on eBay. Maybe someone's gonna buy it. I they've made of Sanyo, LG, and because the reason why I mix them up is because I didn't want to use all the high quality sales. Like like no n nobody's gonna want to buy it. Even though I tell them the sales are new, so I just I put a mixture of this one, this ones, and some Sam Samsung sales. I had I had a bunch of these ones too. It's a 28, 2.8 amp power cells. I had a bunch of them, so I just mixed them up. But I, I didn't just mix them up. I had to test them because I, I wanted to be sure. No, I don't want somebody to buy and say, "Oh, it doesn't work." You see, I have to test everything. I have to test everything to make sure. So my scooter has been like it has been nine months. I bought it on March. I bought it man, February something. I got it on March. But everything is running. Now I have I have the loud horn. I have the key. I don't have the the I mean, I mean, the factory display I can't really add and I have twelve too. So now so I mean, I mean, some of the significant things that I've done on this scooter is and I have the phone mounts. Now I can start the scooter like because before I had a controller failure, which was terrible. I didn't want it to happen again, so because the first time when I got it, everything was inside. It got so hot that one controller gave up. So because one controller gave up, I couldn't wire it home. It was it was a bad controller. The controller that was powering the the, the rear motor it gave up, so the front couldn't move because there was like friction, some stuff like that, holding the front motor from going. So. I had to change that. So now, if if the front one, if the front one is not working, the back one is gonna work. If the back one is not working, the front one is gonna work. So this is the, instead of having two motor arms, I just press. So when I when I put the key, when I turn it, the front, I mean this one start moving. If I press this button, the front one start moving. Which means if the if the back one is bad. The phone is gonna keep moving. If the phone is bad, the back is gonna keep moving. Which means I won't have to get stuck and push my 80 pound scooter home or have to take Uber like that. So now I have like, but somebody crash crash it again. So I don't have like all those factory stuff that came on it. They are gone. I've I've had to replace one tire, the the, the back one because I do burn out a lot. So I have to replace it. But now I don't do any more burn out because. The tire cost me like $54. I don't want to pay that much money on the tire again. So, no more burnouts. Then now I have a, I have a control light. Let me see. Let me go get it. So, right now I have, I have this controller for the LED lights. So when I press this, you see, I got it on AliExpress, but this one stopped working. Cheap, cheap AliExpress lights. So when I press this one, the light, one, the red one comes in. 
that when I press this button, this button is for the for the blue one. So now I now have to let I'm blue flashing. Red and blue, then at the back I have this one. Yeah, and I have so I can change it many many ways. So I do like this. I do like this. Or I do like this. So now it has like my multi functions. So which is really cool at night. So now I have a car horn or the cycle horn is very loud at night so so like this, this is what my scooter looks like nine months later you know? I'm happy that it's still running even though I've done so many many stuff on it but the good part of it is that it's still running I'm gonna tell them to to I'm, so I'm gonna take this split to a mechanic Tend to put four holes, then cut it like this. Cut it like this, just the way it was when I got it. So it sits somewhere like this. So you're gonna sit like this. Then this, then the the seat post is gonna be here in the middle. And I'm gonna mount the seat. So this is what I want it looks like. So because. Because I bought a hole on the deck, I'm gonna tell him to cut it. So, I, so I mean, this one, this so, so this wells won't be affected. So this, so guys, this is what it looks like nine months later, still running, no major issues. Even though I have some issues, but that's, you know, that's what I expected. But the good part of, it, of this is that it's still running. It's winter. My battery is doing very well. Everything, I'm happy. Alright guys, take care and stay safe. Bye.